Uh, you could argue that I look like a twat right now and you'd be 100% correct. I literally look like an idiot. Um, but that's okay because I'm here to talk to you about... Can you see the moon? There it is. Yeah, that right there is the moon. That is the moon. That is literally the moon. Like, the moon that we read about in the speakings and things. Um, but what you won't be able to see, I mean, I could try. Oh, fucking hell, you can see it. I'm fucking stunned. You can actually see that twinkling star. So do you see that? That is right there, basically. So right there, right above my finger there, there's like a twinkling star. I mean, could it be the International Space Station? I, I'm sure I hear in things that uh, that the International Space Station is visible from like places. Like, I, oh, have I literally, yeah. I think I literally just spat on the camera there, so that's cool. <laughs> Not at all embarrassing, which is good. Um, but yeah, I could literally, like that thing is like, you kind of saw it a little bit there, but it's literally twinkling so much. And I don't know, just looking at it, it makes me feel weird. Like, I'm looking at it right now, I stopped. And I looked at it and I was like, that's mental. Like, that is literally twinkling a lot. And it's just like, fuck. And like, obviously, I'm not being profound or anything. This is not me saying this. This is, loads of people have said this, just checking behind me. Um, they've got a coffee machine. Um, right there, co coffee machine. Um, yeah, it's not me being profound or whatever, but it just makes you feel small. And it's just weird. It's just weird seeing things in the sky at night it's kind of beautiful to be honest my hand is so cold so cold because i'm wearing gloves in the other hand but on this hand because i wanted to talk about a star i took the glove off and i'm literally getting frothed by it so i'm now holding it with the gloved hand which is definitely dangerous so i'm going to drop it so i'm actually just going to go because that's really all i was going to say stupid video um minor news quite sad quite not sad just upset same thing uh there's this con for youtubers for food youtubers that uh kind of dame drops and uh ken domic have set up um it's called crave con and basically anyone who is anyone in food youtube food review tons is going and it's in august in texas Hence my problem. Um, I definitely can't afford to go, which is fine. Uh, it's just like, it's kind of a frustrating thing. It's like, oh, there's this thing, like a convention, that is literally set up for the thing that you spend all your time on, trying to build uh, <coughs> from, you know, trying to build, and you can't go kind of annoying kind of really frustrating but this is one of those things that, um you know like it'd be really good for the channel like so many people are going like um my british friends where's my challenger going and whatnot but yeah um yeah just five minutes now so i'm kind of feeling slightly depressed at the moment and honestly food review uh its performance has slowed down a little bit this month um I used to get about 350 subscribers a month. I'm getting about 130 at the moment. So it's like really gone down, like significantly the performance, the performance has gone down. I don't know, I don't know why it is, it's weird. It's weird, but you know, you've got to keep on keeping on. Um, yeah, that's all I, all I can say really. Uh, thanks for watching. I know that you guys who are watching this far are the real supporters of me. I appreciate that. And uh, yeah, take a look at the stars once in a while, guys. Hashtag beautiful.